photography what a morning um where do i start really i mean it, there's been a beautiful inversion a temperature inversion on the plains of worcestershire i haven't even seen herefordshire over the other side uh, because the hills run north to south as you can see and over the other side is herefordshire and wales uh, and i don't even know what's going on over that side uh, worcestershire is is this side and it's the flat part and when there is a big temperature swing, or at least it's very cold and uh, low wind, high pressure, you usually get a temperature inversion on, on this side, on the Worcestershire side. Um, so, of course, having seen the, the forecast, I knew there was only one place that I was going to come this morning. Uh, yesterday, the restrictions were lifted. The travel restrictions are eased, I should say. It was March the 29th yesterday, uh, a massive day. For photographers and anyone who's, uh, you know, travels to, to create content because we're all a little bit sick and tired of our local walks and loops of the river. And as much as I love Worcester and everything I've managed to create over the last, well, year really, um, I'm sick of it. And there was only one place I was going to head today, which was the Mulvans. And even though I can see Worcester and even though I only live sort of five, six miles away, we made the decision very early on that we were going to exercise from our front door uh, and return to the front door by foot. Uh, we didn't drive to exercise anywhere. We never came here once. So it's been literally three months since I've sat here. So I missed the back end of winter. I missed some, some ice and some snow and some really good conditions. But at least I'll be able to be here for the spring, which was taken away from me last year because of lockdown one but this has just been massive coming out yesterday morning because we came for a recce and just to stretch our legs and just because we could because we wanted to get to the hills uh, we actually came for sunrise and sunset yesterday uh, to different to different areas of the hills uh, and when i saw that the the, the, the temperature was going to be as it is this morning i knew that it was going to be a good place to come this morning so yesterday was more about getting reacquainted with the hills and just stretching our legs and treading on different ground and this morning was more about the photography so so let me tell you a little bit more about the photography that i did this morning i shot uh on the canon eos r i got the long lens out because when you get these cloud inversions like we've got today these or i shouldn't really say cloud inversions these temperature inversions Little, little things stick up out of the mist and because it's quite a not an urban or densely populated area but there's little collections of villages pockets of civilizations around the hills so you get little churches that pop up 
uh, and you can see all the Scots pines and the conifers that stick up and you get these shapes and, and figures and especially when the sun actually rises because you go on a little journey on an inversion at, at the, the Mulvans. You get the reddy, pinky, purpley, magenta tones early on and then when the sun actually comes up you get the golden light which blasts straight for you and you get these lovely long shadows and uh, you, you get a really, really nice effect of anything that sticks above the, above the mist and the fog. It, re it really is, it really is nice when you can get the 200mm lens out and photograph straight into that. So that's what I was doing this morning. I was, I was just photographing quite long scenes. I did a panorama. I did a, a wide shot of a collection, cluster of trees up there. Um, and yeah, I got, I got some, some decent stuff, but this morning wasn't solely about the photography. The photography was nice. It was just nice to be back and doing what I love, which is getting the camera out, getting up here for five, six o'clock, on my own, on me Todd, with all my mates around me, with all my friends. And um, it was, it was just joyous. It was biblical. And I just feel like we've turned a corner. Have we turned a corner? Let's hope so. The UK anyway, feels like it's healing slightly. So I just hope that it's the same where you are if you're not from the UK, if you're overseas. Um, I've got some plans to do a bit more travelling locally uh, before I start going nationally uh, next month. Uh, so I've got a few more ideas and there will be a few more vlogs to come. But yeah, oh, feels so good to be back. Tripod in the corner set up. It just looks so, such a familiar sight. And um, it's like I've never been away. So that's how it feels. So let's, uh, let's, end, this, let's end this vlog here. And I want to thank you for watching. I hope you've managed to get something from it, even if it's just a little bit of inspiration just to get out with your camera. Because you can now. Yes, we can. What a feeling that is. And um, yeah, I really, really hope that you're, you're going to find the, uh, the inspiration to get out with your camera because spring is springing all around us and it feels good. So I'm going to leave it here. So thanks for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you on the next video, whatever that may be about. Take it easy wherever you are in the world. And I'll see you soon.